previously on Transformers Fallout. Back in your cell. You got less than a quarter tank and thought you could run. Prisoner, energy signatures, detected. They're my prisoners. I'm bringing them in. Hop on! We've got no choice. I'm taking her in. I am Krennix. And welcome to Quintessa 96. A techno organic? Organic? In a matter of speaking, its organs work in tandem with its internal mechanics. The first round of fully functional techno organic Cybertronians. Wait. Ape Link was a prime after the fall of the First Dynasty. Everyone during that era was animalistic. Entirely cosmetic. Cybertronian DNA is strictly mechanical. Abnormalities aside, in its natural state, techno-organics cannot thrive. And that is where we intervene. Stay behind me! What troubles you? What's he doing here? Who? Shockwave. He posed as an Autobot to infiltrate our government and resurrect Megatron. Merely mistaken identity. Many share this mold. It is not uncommon. Didn't he die back on Cybertron? Evidently not. He is an empty vessel. A sparkless research assistant of my own creation. The coldness of space offers sparse companionship. TFX-42 merely completes work that one lone being cannot. He bears no connection to this shockwave. My apologies for any discomfort. You are free to stay as long as you like. Room B-127 on the second deck is most sufficient. Rest well. We shall mingle in the early cycles. You coming? Hey, you still up? I am now. What's on your mind? Ready to ask you the same thing. How did you know him? Who? Shockwave. That wasn't usual con PTSD. You have your past. I got mine. I mean, we haven't known each other super long, but... Seeing you get freaked out like that? Care to reminisce? There's just... so many ways to say no. You sure it's him? Let's go find out. Power levels converge here. Bot or con, we don't use charging ports. I think it's an interface. He has something this Quintesson wants. No empty vessel is worth a cortical psychic patch. Okay, so... now what? I'm gonna see what all the fuss is over. Plugging in? Is that... really the safest idea? Everything will be fine. Trust me. You want me to stand guard, or...? That. Or you could do some snooping. I don't know how much I'll get from him, so every clue counts. Just... stay on your toes. Mind telling me why we're here? Unbelievable. Your front row for free, mind you. Shockwave. Oh, fine, fine. You see the one over there? The bot with the drill bit and stripes?
Word has it he's the top pick for the Eroticon poster boy. Wins every match. The Eroticons have tried to kick out Sentinel Prime for cycles. They're nothing but hopeless stragglers. Wrong. The members range in the millions. But active Eroticons are so few because of weak leadership. That'll change. If he takes charge. This guy? Some minor turned gladiator, right? Fancies himself an activist? Tronus or something like that? Megatron! Megatron! Shockwave. Shockwave. Shockwave, I... What the... No, not a chance. Try your last. I told you, I didn't want a strings pulled. When that's all you're hanging from, you don't get to be picky. You're welcome, by the way. Special favors and behind-the-scenes dealings? You really are a politician. What? No! Why? Sentinel's planted his roots, which means the economy's gonna keep getting slammed. This is security in a world of layoffs. You're taking the job. But... Warden? I'm a holocoder, not some fragging babysitter. Coding isn't viable. Not anymore. You force a miserable job at piecemeal salary on me and demand gratitude? What were you expecting? I'm expecting you to be logical. Palm serial scan. Let's make it official. Now wait a- Hey! Hey! System processing just needs a click. 
slaghead! Give it here! Wait, wait. Almost there and... Oh! So it wasn't what you were aiming for. That's not how life usually plays out. Sure worked out for you, Mr. Senator. Hey, look at me. It's just the long way around. Until everything cools down. Trust me. I would like to keep this investigation private, thank you. Let's add a little translation subroutine. Subject 1, subject 49, subject 390? No! No, please! Just let us go! We won't- <laughs> Subject WXB58 is showing signs of discomfort. With the cosmetic adjustments out of the way, we introduce modified transwarp radiation, producing the desired mutagenic effect. What the frag are you doing? Get out. Not until you tell me. <coughs> so that's what you've been doing? Locked away and ripping yourself to shreds? My political career is dead. My reputation forever soiled. All I have left is your friend. Is it the same one who pummeled the Radicons at a public event? My re election campaign? I had no choice. You had the choice to do nothing! The Radicons are thugs, and so is that murderer you painted the 14th Prime. Sentinel bought and sold every ethical route. We're heading for a dictatorship, and none of these idiots can see it! Say we are. If you let Megatron murder a Prime and seize control, Sentinel will be a prophet. All his fear tactics will be validated. He'll go from dictator to martyr overnight. You can't do it, can you? You're rupturing your frontal left processor. The part that controls your emotions. Your conscience. If Megatron's so virtuous, why go to such extremes? Maybe, because deep down you know this isn't just questionable. It's evil. And the bot I've known forever is no killer. Shockwave, don't! <laughs> Z 
such drive, you shall stand greatly above the rest. Let us start with the most invasive test. Pain tolerance. <laughs> I hoped to unleash my creations under more ideal circumstances. What happens next? The spilt blood. Oh dear. There goes the surprise. Autobot morale and superstition is what founded the political degeneracy which plagues Cybertron. Megatron will restore our race. Even if he must rule over Ash, his kingdom shall rise. I once aided you in redirection. Creativity was your purpose. Without me, you would not have found new meaning in a concluding spark of my former life. I am inspired to do the same. Farewell, old friend.